Ice Boldu here. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Storm Silver Nuzlocke. So, last episode, we went and faced Misty, and we won. We won, uh, with no losses. S some, some sketchy situations, uh, but no losses were had. And now, I believe we're just gonna be moving on to Vermilion. Are we going the right way? Route 5. We don't have an encounter here, do we? Well, let me check the... that's... Check the, the map. We have a Route 6 encounter, but we don't have a Route 5 encounter. So let's head on down here. See what we can get. Uh, I believe we get like a spell tag in here. Yeah, I sent a sinister shadow hovering over you. Take this to ward it off. Cleanse tag. Okay, close enough. You are in mortal danger, but you're protected now. Well, thank you. My grandma is into warding off what she believes to be evil spirits. I'm sorry that she startles you. It's like, my grandma is insane. I apologize. Okay, so, our Route 5 encounter is... A Weepin' Bell. Wait, wait, don't we have a... Don't we have a bell sprout? I feel like we have a bell sprout. I'm running. If we, if we don't have a bell sprout, then I definitely just fucked that up. I feel like we caught a bell sprout really early on. Did I? I we did. We did. We did. Okay, so that was speech. Yeah, we, we got James chilling in the back. Okay. So let's go see if we can get ourselves something else. No, weeping bell. I'm sorry. No. Might Yenna. That, we definitely don't have a Poochiena. So, Might Yenna it is. You should live a Night Slash. You resist it. Oh, you eat that. Embargo. Alright. So, a female Might Yenna. Uh, I wouldn't even know what's name a male Might Yenna. To be honest, but... Maybe maybe the Pokedex entry will give us some ideas. I don't know. Let's see. Might you know the bite Pokemon? It chases down prey in a pack of around 10. They defeat foes with perfectly coordinated teamwork. Oh god. Uh Alright, alright. I got I got a you know another nice nice and Fire Emblem reference name. Valoria. Awesome. So let's head down to uh, Vermilion. I don't remember the name of it. It starts with a V. It's not Viridian. Yeah, Ver it's gotta be Vermilion. Like, there, there's gonna be. Hidden items in here. We got a full restore. Hello. Be afraid I'm not a bad person. A place like this attracts mean people. They would they would eventually cause trouble. Makes me mad. Just think about it. Ah, oh, that's a rage candy bar. Can I have it, please? Uh, sure. I glad I talked to, I suppose. We gave the rage candy bar to the guy at the underground path. Lunch. How upsetting. But this is so good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It makes me mad. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm feeling much better. Thank you for your candy. I want you to have this. TM64. TM64 contains... Is it explosion? God, what the, was that dialogue necessary, Dreano? Was it really necessary? Is it explosion? 64... Yes, okay. Get an item right here. X special, okay. And that was it? Oh, okay. That's fine. Dish fan. So route six, we already have our encounter. Uh, because we already explored this route. But up we go. And let's go look at Valoria. 48 quick feats, which I don't remember what that does. Boost speed. Oh, yeah, yeah, status ailment. Okay. 
Uh, it is careful nature. Uh, doesn't really help. I mean, special defense, woo. It's a physical attacker and all that needs a speed. It's frail anyway, so, you know. There's our Mygiana. Let's go ahead and heal up. And I guess we'll go ahead and take on the gym. We've already explored this town. Um, so that's all there really is left for us to do. So I guess we're, we're gonna just... From one episode, we're gonna hop straight to the, the next one with gym. Oh. Please tell me you're open. No. Mm -hmm. uh, I I thought I thought this was different in this game. I thought the trash cans were gone. Oh no. So we got a double battle here. The trash can gym. I love Lieutenant Surge, but his gym is actually is actually a uh, night slash the Rotom. I'm try attacking the Electabuzz. I probably shouldn't even stay in on the Electabuzz, to be honest, but I'm pretty confident that we're high enough level over this Electabuzz that with the stab adaptability, Electabuzz is going down. Yep. Rotom, I don't know I don't know what Rotom's gonna do. Sub. And an electrode. The electrode is getting targeted first. Like, no, no explodey, no explodey today. Alright, get that sub out of here, and what is this, what is this Rotom doing? Shark. Charge sub, huh? I'm gonna flamethrower the Magneton, and try attack the Rotom, get Rotom out, stop it. No, none of that. I, I don't think Kix is gonna be able to take this Magneton out. I could be wrong. I was not wrong. Magnet Rise and Rotom Wash. Okay, I'm gonna Night Slash the Magneton and try attack the Rotom Wash. So does this this one dude have just six Rotoms? Well, I guess he can't have six Rotoms. Well, there, there aren't even six Rotom forms, are there? But he has at least, he probably has three Rotoms. All right, so there we go. Rotom, the best one I love. I love me some Rotom Frost. Rotom Frost is great. Oh, oh wait, wait, wait. I should have been Dark Pulsing. Wait, no. No, they're not. I guess Dragon changed that? Or maybe that's just Platinum or, or Diamond and Pearl? I don't know. One of the games, Rotom's type does not change. Depending on the form. But I'm, I'm clearly hitting it with, with normal type moves. So, it's not this game. There's a Rotom fan. Kick sits level 59. Rotom Mo. Get your nice beam. There we go. Okay. So, Rotom Boy. Nice. Uh, Kix is full health. You know what? Let's, let's fight this guy before we go back and heal. Uh, and then we will get cracking on this puzzle. We got a Manetric. I'm gonna... I live another one. As long as he doesn't crit. I don't know if I can live that though. That was a crit? Wow. Okay. Do that again. Oh my god, full restored turn. Get out. There we go. Apparently it was a speed tie. Okay, interesting. We got a Luxray. Luxray is dark type in this game. I'm not gonna bother staying in. Um, let's go into Coat Rack. Coat Rack can get the the super effective move against it. Uh, I am kind of worried of being hit with a special move, but at the end of the day, we land a. Okay, you already outsped me. I don't know why you wanted to go for the scary the scary face. Um, but you kind of wasted your turn there, buddy. Catch this, you know, choice banded. Super effective. Hammer. There you go. Alright. So let's go heal up and then we will try and get through this puzzle. Uh, I don't... Maybe it, it's changed and the trash can thing is still there. I'm not sure. I'm just remembering Gen 1 trash cans. And... 
it's it's terrible. One of the LPs I did, I don't remember which one. It was either maybe it was blue. I don't know, but I was I actually had to cut away because I was in here for 40 minutes. Not, not exaggerating. I was actually in doing doing the stupid trash can stuff. Secret switch. Okay. Oh, this is how he does it. Okay, okay, so... Oh, wait. Okay, no, never mind. It is the same exact thing. Got it. But I was actually in here for 40 minutes. Uh, there are a lot less trash cans here. Than the original, which helps. Because the original... Like, if, if you don't know how this puzzle works, you, you gotta hit one switch, and then the swi the other switch is directly next to it, on one of the directions. No. Um, and if you don't get, get it on the, you know, r one right after another. So, out of curiosity. Okay, we got him. It wasn't too terrible, uh, but it, it was just random, and it's all types of awful. But Lieutenant Surge, do I want to lead with kicks? I mean, Young Continent's gonna be the way to, to win this, most likely, but I also have a feeling he has something to deal with the ground types. Um, I think, if, if I'm remembering correctly, I believe his, his Raichu is a surfing Raichu. So gotta keep that in mind, but otherwise, let's get into it. Hey, you little tight! I may not be very smart, it may not be very smart to challenge me, but it takes guts. When it comes to electric type Pokemon, I'm number one. I've never lost on the battlefield. I'll zap you just like a dude all my enemies in battle. God damn. Alright, Lieutenant Surge. Let's get it going. Whew. Magnazone is his lead. Kicks. I mean, we should be able to live a hit, right? It's definitely gonna live a flamethrower. We should be able to live a hit, though, right? Oh my god, kicks. <gasps> Zap cannon. <laughs> Why did I stay in? Because I'm dumb. Um... I was hoping this flamethrower would do at least, like, a little over half so I could make sure I two-shot it, but I get the crit, and we do two-shot it. Thank you, Kix. Thank you for coming through. Was he an Electivire? That... See, here's the problem with Electivire. Electivire in this game is electric flying, so... JJ, if I hit him with the fly, he'd be gone. Um, but if he hits me with the electric type, I'm probably gone. No Varg. Could probably maybe do something, I don't know. I guess our best bet is Young Continent, but I have a strong, strong feeling that he's gonna have Ice Punch, but we really have no other options. We really don't have any other options uh, other than just coming in and going straight for the Earthquake. He does have the Ice Punch. It's not Stab. I know this is an Electivire, but it's not Stab. You got this, Young Continent. I know it's times four. Yes. Ooh. All right. Now one shot him. One shot him. Teach him how to do super effective damage. Please. Oh, yes, Young Continent. Yes. Thank you. Okay. So Young Continent coming through, taking out the Electivire, living his times four super effective hit. And Ampros is coming in. Um, why do I feel like you're gonna have Focus Blast? Why is it like every Pokemon is like, oh, I can bring Novarg out against this, but then it's like this thing can definitely has access to Focus Blast. I guess we're staying in on Young Continent. I don't think we'll outspeed it, so I'm not even gonna try. I'm just gonna go straight for the Hyper Potion. What, what are you gonna do? Signal Beam. Is that neutral? No, it's super effective. Okay. We should eat that. Yeah, we eat that. For some reason, I always think, like, ground resists bug, but it never does. It's uh, it's always rock that I'm thinking of. 
So I'm like, well, I'm, I'm, I'm ground. I should resist that. No. So I was thinking it, I, it would be neutral. Uh, but it's clearly not. But it doesn't do much damage to begin with. So this Ampharos. Uh, I know Ampharos is kind of bulky. Slightly. But, like, not not enough to, to live that. Clearly. So you're Continent coming through. Hitting level 66. Aish. Get yourself some left. Those Raichu is coming in. Okay, so this is Raichu. Oh, we can have Focus Blast. Uh, young Kana just stay in. I was like, I want to go into Novark. I really want to go into Novark, but it's a Raichu. At the end of the day, it's a Raichu. I don't think I'm going to outspeed it with Novark, and I'm going to catch the meanest of Focus Blasts. Nasty plotting. Oh, Lord. Young Continent. You got to kill him. Imagine if he had a, an air balloon. You know how screwed I would be if he pack if he was packing air balloon Raichu. That would be smart. He should have done that. That would have put a huge damper on on all all of my plans. Especially you know turn one with with the nasty plot. Ooh, ooh, that would have been that would have been brutal. But it's fine. Raichu is down. I'm sorry, Raichu. You're my second favorite Pokemon. But you had to go because you're not mine. Got a Jolteon who's definitely gonna outspeed me. You probably out. Oh, not not expecting that. I was expecting like Pin Missile or a Signal Beam. I'm gonna hit myself. No, Young Continent coming through. He does not hit himself. He goes straight for them kills. Get out. I was like, I I don't even. We don't even need to watch it. It's dead. If I one-shot everything else, a Jolteon, you, you best believe, is being one-shot. So finally, an Electrode. Of course it is. Coat Rack. I, I kind of want to go into Coat Rack because... Explosion. But... Uh, I'm not going to because he might carry something else. It's not over yet. It's just the beginning. Uh, are you sure? Are you sure this is the beginning? Oh no. Oh, don't. Don't do this. Don't do this. Young Continent. Oh god, that hurt. Three double teams. Surge, why? What the fuck? What did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Young Continent does not care. He's like, you, you, you can go ahead and do that. You, you get the plus three evasion. See, see what I care. See what I care. Because I don't. Get out. Gone. Destroyed. You do cheaty ass double team tactics. Get, get out of here. My electric trick. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Ah, uh, you're strong. Okay, kid, you get the thunder badge. Right, we got our third Kanto Gym Badge already. That Thunder Badge suits those who defeated me. Take good care of it, okay? There's something else. Here's a great TM for you. And TM 34, is that Shockwave? That TM can name Shockwave. Zap! Use it to go like lightning. You should head towards Celadon. Take the Rock Tunnel route. Perhaps we could have an electrifying rematch sometime. I'll give you my telephone number. Okay, so it was Shockwave. Uh, we never saw it because ground type. But awesome! Surge is defeated. So I guess we can try and make our way to Celadon. I don't... I don't know how we go about that in this game. Because typically... Typically you go north. Can we pass through this? Hold up, the city is currently recovering from a blackout. You have to come back later. Oh, okay. So I guess we do have to go through Rock Tunnel into Lavender, Lavender, Lavender Town, and uh, and go left to Celadon, as you do traditionally. Oh, I need cuts. I hate that I need cut to get through this. Like Drano removed, or maybe maybe it wasn't Drano that removed it. I don't know, but cut. 
And the worst part is I can't fly to the Pokemon Center on the other side. Otherwise, this would be so much easier. Because I've been there. You guys know we've been there, because we had to go out there for the power plant bullshit. Well. Get out of my way. Alright, thanks Dante, you served your purpose. Now, give me, no, give me Young Continent back. Okay, uh, based on time, we can, we can get a head start into Rock Tunnel. We can get our encounter for sure. Uh, we probably, yeah, it's dark, that's fine. Uh, if it's the same Rock Tunnel, which it is absolutely not the same Rock Tunnel. I have no idea where I'm going then. This will be fun. This will be great. Grand old time. We still haven't run into anything. As I say that, we find... A Kangaskhan. Well, we definitely don't have a Kangaskhan. Um... I guess Night Slash it? I don't double hit. Okay. Go for another. It's gonna double hit me again. Interesting. What type? Isn't double hit? No, it's not dragon, is it? No, double hit is is like Ambipom's move. So I can go into coat rack and Ultra Ball. Look at that double hit. And was thinking, oh, I just have double hit. He was going for the double edge. Come on, now, King's not. I know you are kind of a bit oh kind of a bitch to catch. Can we not? Can we not do this? I would appreciate it if we didn't. Do I have any status ailments? Like I can poison it. Uh I think that's all I have is toxic. Get in oh, there we go. About to say, don't don't do this to me, Kangaskhan. Don't do this. It's got Kangaskhan, the parent Pokemon. To protect its young, it will never give up during battle, no matter how badly wounded it is. Kangaskhan. Um, I like to name Kangaskhan. Let's see if it'll. I have a feeling it's not gonna. It's not gonna fit. Oh no, it'll fit. Kanga and Rue. Where's the and? There's, there's an ampersand somewhere, right? Please tell me there is. Is there not? My dumb and I'm looking straight at it. Is there no ampersand? There's no ampersand. No ampersand! Ampersand! No! There's a percent sign. Um, A N D R O. No. I don't have another name for Kangaskhan. I can use a plus for an and. Fuck it. This is a Kanga and Roo. Don't understand. You you you, you got to get on your Winnie the Pooh grind, man. You got to you got to do it. Uh, I have no idea where we are. Cause this is not the Rock Tunnel. I know we could have got narrow Uh That's kind of scary. This kicks is in here. He just tried to boomerang me that <laughs> boomerang me. Uh we would not have enjoyed that whatsoever. Uh I think JJ needs to be leading this expedition. Are you do I need Rock Smash to get through here? Primate. Definitely have one of those. Well, Graveler, nope, nope, out. Laron, that could have been neat. Uh, I guess we'll try and figure this out. I'm, I'm not using Flash. I will get a map for the next episode. I thought, you know what? I've been through Rock Tunnel. This isn't the same Rock Tunnel. This is absolutely not the same Rock Tunnel. But let's look at Kanga and Rue. Uh, before we wrap up this episode. Oh, before Jolly Nature. 
Ooh, that's really good. And early bird, so sleep is for the weak. Double hit, sucker punch, reversal, and double edge. I believe it gets outrage by level up somewhere around this level, maybe, I believe. I don't remember. I know, I just know it gets it by level up. But that's pretty cool. Kangaskhan's an interesting Pokemon. Don't see it every day. I mean, in in an LP or Nuzlocke format, I should say. In VGC, uh, it's everywhere. So, there's there's that. But, anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. We got we got a nice, nice three Kanto badges, and we're going to be taking on Rock Tunnel. And maybe getting our fourth, depending on how much time we have left. Who knows? Uh, in the next episode. But, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I will see you all next time.